Abenadorm-loving nan with over 150 grandchildren and great-grandchildren has died at the age of 90. Mum of 10 Jean Clark from Speak had nearly 200 direct living descendants in her lifetime. Back in 2021, The Echo reported how Jean had 47 grandchildren, 115 great-grandchildren and 15 great-great-grandchildren. But there's since been more additions to the family. At one point, the family thought Jean, who loved bingo, Benidorm and big family parties, could also hold the Guinness Book of Records title for the largest living family in the world. Jean, who would have been 91 in December, died on October 4th, but has left a massive legacy to loved ones and the wider community. Granddaughter Christine Bird told The Echo, quote, She was just very family-oriented. Her family came before anything. She was just a real all-round family woman. She loved her family. She just loved company. She was lovely, funny, down-to-earth, bubbly, but also very straight. If she had something to say, she'd let you know. She absolutely loved the bingo. She loved Benidorm. She loved a cruise. She loved her family, and she loved a big family party. Her birthday is December 21st, so for the last 10 years or so, we've had a big party for her every year where we all get together and celebrate her. We're still going to do something to celebrate her birthday this year. Christine previously told The Echo her nan had been on her own for years and raised her 10 children pretty much single-handedly. Sadly, out of 10 children, she lost one at six weeks to cot death and one of her daughters developed leukemia and died aged 12. Jean also lost her daughter, Julie, Christine's mum, in 2017 after a battle with cancer. Her surviving children are Sue, Tony, Sandy, Jackie, Sammy, Mickey and Karen, and Jean's family and legacy continues to grow. Christine said, quote, She had a little tatty old birthday book, a little black book, and all the birthdays used to go in that. It was actually falling to pieces at one point, and I said, Nan, can I buy you a new book? And she said, you can sod off if you think I'm writing all those birthdays out again. She has loads of pictures with newborns in the family, but whenever there was a new baby, she'd have to get her hair done. We'd ask, can we have a picture or selfie with the new baby? And she'd say, no, not yet, I've not had my hair done. After appearing in The Echo in 2021, Jean also declined an invitation to go on ITV's This Morning. Christine said she wanted everyone to know how wonderful her nan was, and that Jean had said, I've had my name in the paper, that will do me just fine. Christine said, quote, She was made up. She was very proud. She had little pieces of the echo put up on the wall in her flat. Christine also said her nan's funeral was absolutely packed, with all the guests unable to fit in the church. She said the family were also warmed by the kind messages and memories shared on social media about their queen, Jean. Christine said, quote, she was from Speak, and I put a post on the Speak Past and Present group on Facebook about her. The amount of people who commented, it just goes to show how well-loved she was. It was warming. It was just so lovely to hear people's stories about my nan. It just meant a lot, and it was very comforting for the whole family. How I'm feeling is how the whole family is feeling. She's left a massive void. She really was our queen.